Not really sure where you start a video like this. And now I am pointing at the creek. So standing at the foot of the driveway, and this is almost a year since we first arrived. This photo was taken a while back, and this is looking where the driveway will be prepped. And these next photos, you see what amazing amount of work can be done in one day with the right people and the right machinery. Here we are in November, all the way at the other end of the land, and this is where we think a second driveway would go nicely. This photo was taken in December. On the left, you can see a compost pile started, and on the right, a garden. Here we are in January, first snowfall. And that tree that's on the left and now in the center with all the limbs gone. Later on, I'll show where it falls over on this land and has become quite useful. Our first farm critter has arrived. February here. This is the box that we built for the worms. And the live worms arrived in a box, and inside there, there was a bag. And there's a hole in the box. Here we are opening the bag and placing them in the box that we built. They arrived healthy and well. We found they're nearly indestructible. They reproduce quickly, so quickly that we're up to three boxes now. We use the soil that they create for our garden. Now, coming here up in March, our newest critters have arrived. And we're looking at, on the left, rosemary. In the middle is grace. And on the right, that's marshmallow. The kittens are approximately nine weeks old here. Now I'm standing at the bottom of the driveway. And here's the strawberries and spinach and lettuce. I think you can see the spinach. Oh, and there's also radish, too. It's kind of hard to get a good view of this cage on here. Let's see. There we go. There's the spinach. And behind it, that little red. That's the lettuce. Here we are back in May. And if you're wondering why the video quality has improved so greatly, it's because I received a wonderful Mother's Day present of a GoPro camera. I'm still learning to use it. This here I filmed at 120 frames per second, and I believe it was 1080 resolution, which is lower. Kind of did that so that I could reduce the file size and make transfers a little simpler. In the lower right there in this photo, you see some logs that are standing up there that are weathered. Those came from the tree that I spoke of earlier that fell over and landed on our side of the road. I've used the outer bark for the garden, and much of that wood will be great firewood, or just a great seat. Well, that about concludes this first video. Hope you've enjoyed watching. I appreciate it. And I'll close by showing the latest critters that we've introduced to the homestead.